All right, hello, and welcome to Echo's Color with Jeffrey Morrison. How's it going? All right, we're going to do another whip and chat here. Craftably is Midnight Warrior by Sarah Burrier. Uh, 20 inches by 28 inches, round drill. 62 colors in total, including two AABs, which stands for Aurora, Aurora Borealis. Oh, boy. <laughs> They're just an iridescent coated type of drill that sparkles a little brighter than that of regular drills. And two rhinestones, usually silver bottomed uh, drills with a kind of translucent or see-through top. Yeah, I tried recording a, another weapon chat last night, but I just deleted it. Wasn't really talking. <laughs> I was more tired than anything, so... Yeah, <laughs> I slept a bit more, a bit better, so yeah. Yeah, so it's like Christmas Eve day here. Roads are still closed and snow is still blowing around. Uh, going to my brother's house boxing day now. We just decided to, to stay home, <laughs> so all good. It'll definitely be a white Christmas. That's that's good, but yeah, <laughs> still cars on the road, even though the highways are technically closed. Still, there's like a train stranded somewhere here in Ontario. I think I just saw a car pass. Like the visibility is like totally gone now. The sun, we, we've seen the sun, it's like shone above all this blowing snow and stuff, but it's gone away again. <laughs> the sun's gone again. Saw a little chickadee flying on the front lawn earlier. So these birds just stick around. Yeah, somebody said that, uh, yeah, birds probably have it figured out, cold winter months figured out, so. Yeah, but it seems like if it's, like, deathly cold out, it's like, oh dear. <laughs> like, is there, like, shelter for, like, all the birds in the world? It's like, woof. But you know. Alright, just placing some ABs here since I have tweezers. Yeah, it's the that coating. The Aurora Borealis coating. This is her shoulder. So an interesting place for ABs, but I guess this is a spot that has a lot of light from the moon possibly. Shining on her shoulder. So. Her glowing <laughs> on her shoulder. I think the moon reflects the sun's light. Yeah, it, the moon is rock, I guess. The sunlight is reflected off the moon. Yeah, I think that's how it goes. Well, well, all good. Yeah. Yeah, rounds have, round drills have the capacity to fling out of the tweezers. Ends of the tweezers. There's, like, an edge, but, yeah. With, like, a square drill. Yeah, you have a couple edges to work with. <laughs> Four edges to work with. Oh, I'm rounds or square drills, so. I'm more for the piece, like what the art is. So, <laughs> feel like I'd be missing out if I, uh, just preferred like square drills or something. Just seems really weird. <laughs> but 
but we all have our preferences. All right. Yeah, so hopefully your holidays are going well if you are in fact off for holiday break. <laughs> Yeah, CW Network already has uh, New Year's movies set up for next weekend <laughs> already. Countdown to Christmas ends before the New Year or something. Yeah, right up to the New Year. <laughs> and then it's just New Year's movies and then I'll go into Valentine's Day shortly after that. Yeah, it just... It just keeps going. <laughs> there are new movies, like the New Year's ones, but five all new movies. Oh, it's all good. It'll make sense in the end. <laughs> uh, yeah. One of us is lying. I thought that series ended. <laughs> we watched the first season of it. Oh, excuse me. There was probably a second one, apparently. Maybe. I don't know if there's like a... This is like the third season that's going to premiere in January. Of One of Us is Lying. I don't know. I thought the... It was just a mini series. Like I think these are books, <laughs> based on books. The series. So. I've never read the books, but it was an interesting uh, concept, I guess. Oh well, there's more to the story, or there's more than one book in this one of us is lying series. Might have been three. I don't know. Eh. I think I read like the opening credits and it was like based on a series of books or something, but yeah. Basically one of those who can you really trust or who's really your friend <laughs> kind of scenarios. Somebody's watching them do very naughty stuff, this group of teenager, teenagers or something. They know what they've done and now they're just tormenting them. <laughs> they're calling it a series. Yeah. Oh, we have to figure out who this person is, What? why they're doing this and all that. Well, they know why they're doing it, but... Uh, I don't know. It's just one of those things that can get dragged out beyond the source material. Yep, that sounds familiar. <laughs> yeah, my mom has sent me like uh, movie adaptations from books that didn't go so good. Yeah, I recognized a couple of them. Overall, the uh, ones that were listed weren't received all that good. Like, they just were terrible for movie adaptations. I remember seeing the Golden Compass movie. Yeah, it, it was terrible. <laughs> and putting seven of Stephen King's uh, Dark Tower books into one really crappy movie. Yeah, I'm sure it ruined it for a lot of people. At least there's always the books. So. But, yeah, i never seen that Dark Tower movie, but yeah, I think the books uh, will just cover the universe better. Get something of that nature. Yeah. Something of that scope. Yeah, it's just a heck of a lot better, the source material. You'd hope. 
Okay, do some more of skin tone here. Yeah, there's just a couple patches of this plus that. Uh, 49. Yeah, I think I was just too tired yesterday to do like a second whip and jet. <laughs> I like barely talked on that one that I had recorded last night and I just got rid of it. <laughs> it's like, uh, so, yeah. Yeah, supervisor wanted me to go into work for somebody that didn't want to come in the other day. I already taken an extra shift this week <laughs> to set up the line for a CIP. I'm like, I know you've worked a lot this week, but can you come in again? And I'm, I was like, yeah, the weather, weather's pretty crappy. No thanks. I hate saying no, but like, there's common sense to a point. Mm. It's like. The roads closed shortly after that. Like, yay, Merry Christmas! You're stuck at work. Like, really? Or even worse, like trapped in a ditch or something. So a patch of black ice or something silly. Oh, a couple of these pluses over here. Sometimes it's just not worth it. Mm. And me being on night shift and like just going back to bed for a couple hours just for another 12 hour shift. It would it would be a 12 hour shift. Would have been. <sighs> Guy that's supposed to be covering the dryer at a period where he didn't show up. So it's like... I used a week of my vacation time. I guess we're like supposed to take two weeks of vacation off. I'm really not one for vacation time. I took a week off and that worked out to babysit my brother's dog while he was in like Paris. Yeah, remember that week? <laughs> Caution dog barking, the, that disclaimer in like every video that week. <laughs> Are you whipping chat that week? Oh, geez, I forgot. Yeah, one of those colors. Okay, that that was a very few drills for her face there. Okay, I'll fill this square in because I already did that color. And just having <laughs> issues with this like uh, patch of hair here. So there's blues in there. Yeah, he must have been really tired yesterday. <laughs> Plus, I had only slept for that couple hours to, like, salvage the day. It was just, yeah. And the crappy weather just didn't help stuff either. Yeah, I'd probably get seasonal eye effect disorder. So. Just kind of coast through it, I guess. So. <laughs> There's like a certain light that you can use to get sunlight or like simula simulated sunlight. It fixes your mood or something, <laughs> endorphins or something. I don't know, I've heard of it, but yeah. Okay, yeah, just the square here, just so it's down 35. 35, okay. Well, we're getting closer to finishing this section, so it's getting better. <laughs> symbol of its kind. Here. 
There we go. It's a quick fill one. Oh, and it happens. Guarantee I miss like symbols every time. But I was pretty sure I did this color already, so. Oh, all good. There's a lot more cars on the road than there was yesterday. Oh boy. I think the snow is basically like drifting around. It's like loose. So I think it's like actually snowing per se. It's just blowing around what had already fallen. Yeah. Uh, much worse. <laughs> I was just lucky I got home the other day. Put gas in my car, like on my way home from work. And yeah, just took my time getting home because I do live on a highway and snow plows only come out after a certain accumulation of snow. Just to save a few bucks. But yeah. The weather's crappy, people should like stay off the roads in general. Really shouldn't have to tell people to stay off the roads, but there's certain people that just have to be out and about. Because <laughs> realistically, Emergency services probably don't want to be out in this stuff in the first place. But there's probably usually someone on duty or on call or whatever that has to deal with these instances. But, you know. Okay, I'll do the capital A here. Yeah, I think we're just having, like, spaghetti tonight. <laughs> it's like, we're not traditional by any means. That's so boring. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's this large patch of blue here. Okay, capital A. This must certainly be, like, the sky or something up further at the top. <laughs> this is a lot of blue. <laughs> this blue. I just need a few in our hair. Oops. Probably way more than I need. Probably need like ten drills. Yeah, at our house here, we usually just celebrate Christmas on Christmas Eve. Open the gifts and all that, then we're, like, done. Oh, if we're doing that tonight, but... <laughs> well, <laughs> spaghetti and open gifts, maybe, I, I don't know. We're just kind of hanging out today. It's like, meh, whatever. <laughs> Just really don't get excited about this stuff. Mm. Yeah, we just really don't get excited about Christmas <laughs> anymore. It's just, just a whole bunch of chaos at the end of the year. Sure, it's nice to have the days off from work, but yeah. Mom well, asking me like when I'm going back to work kind of thing and it's just like I don't know, like uh, the 30th of December, my next shift. 
that I'm done again for morning of the 31st and then have January 1st and 2nd of. And it just begins again. <laughs> and it's the new year and back to normal. Whatever normal is. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Sure, my supervisor will leave a note. Mm. Oh, we've had gone through like three or four potential staff members for the department I work in, but they apply, get hired, and then don't show up for their first shift. It's just infuriating. It's just like, what is wrong with you people? Do you have bills? Ugh. Oh, where well, they're getting their money, but okay. It's really weird to apply. Go through all that process and then just not bother to show up. It's like... for a minute there. <laughs> Dad came into the studio. <laughs> All good. Alright. I think he went down to the shop. So might be background noise. All good. It's a day off. <laughs> as well just like be doing something. <laughs> I know, it's not like I can like just go out and get a cup of coffee or whatever. Things like probably closed by now. <laughs> holidays. Yeah, just mess everything up. <laughs> just like what's open, what's closed, and then winter storm, it's like really <laughs> inside All right. okay yeah there's just like a little pathway of this color here. This is probably her like ponytail or braid of hair. So I'll just go from bottom of the section to the top to fill it in. That drill slid out of the place there. Ah. Oh, pick up the drill. Jeez. <laughs>
keys. Oh, there it is. <laughs> to kind of tease the wax in this pen, the tip. Possibly. Still looks half decent. Oh, what's going on? Right. Well, it's probably going up through a small hole in the tip of the pen. <laughs> see what that does. Yeah, it's better already. Just need to, to tweak the wax on the tip of the pen. I always have a toothpick handy just to salvage as much of the wax on the pen tip as I can. flipped over. Doesn't seem like it. <laughs> Alright. Oops. So yeah, you've been watching Echoes of Color with Jeffrey Morrison. Down below in the description, I put my Facebook profile name, my Echoes of Color Facebook business page, and my Instagram. All three, I just try to update simultaneously. When I like finish a section on our present whip here, work in progress, just brief little updates. And I also post uh, my walking challenge uh, website links, uh, Lord of the Rings for Conqueror and uh, Silk Road for Pacer. I'm not affiliated nor sponsored, but yeah, I just post those websites for information so you know what's going on. <laughs> I do mention it from time to time reading on the treadmill or Lord of the Rings or yeah, five part challenge. So yeah. Yeah, I'm on the Eye of Sauron, the fourth challenge. Lord of the Rings bundle and then it's Mordor. I keep saying Mountain, but I think the last leg is called Mordor. So then you climb my Mount Doom and destroy Poland Ring. But yeah, other than that, happy holidays. Probably heard that like 16 times now <laughs> in the last couple of whipping chats, but hey, you know, never know. All right, so happy holidays. Stay safe. Uh, happy crafting, whatever hobbies, etc. you're doing. If you're just watching, thank you. Always appreciate it. All right, and yeah, hopefully I'll see you soon. Take care. All the best. Bye.